so what's up guys welcome back to the channel so guys in this short video i'm going to show you how to fix imported battery message unavailable to verify this iphone was a genuine apple battery even this iphone have their own and genuine battery and you can see a person screen maximum capacity also disappeared so if you want to fix that issue in your iphone and you want to fix in this video i will show you how you can do that firstly close that tab and open iphone settings ok in settings section you need to scroll down and tap on general ok you can see appears on screen software update make sure you don't have any pending ios update in your iphone if you have pending ios update in your iphone just update your iphone to the latest ios update it will fix your issue like this ok if that method not working for you then move to the next solution the next solution is forced to restart your iphone press volume up button then press volume down button and press the power button until you see the apple logo appears on your iphone screen and your iphone is forced to restart okay if that method is also not working for you and you are still facing this kind of issue on your iphone then move to the next solution the next solution is open iphone settings okay in settings section you need to go back okay after that you need to scroll down and you can see a person screen here are showing transfer or reset iphone okay tap on that option after that you can see a person screen here are showing reset erase all content and setting you need to select the reset okay okay now you can see a person screen reset all settings just select the reset all setting and apply it on your iphone after that check back again your iphone battery health make sure your iphone battery is genuine and you are not replace your iphone battery so there are some method to solve that issue if you don't have any hardware issue in your iphone if you have any hardware issue in your iphone just connect the nearest apple store they will 100 percent fix your issue so friends after watching this video i hope you will all know how to fix this kind of issue on your iphone hope this video is helpful for you if the video is helpful for you don't forget to share and subscribe my youtube channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos notifications thanks for watching